feel embarrassed about your poor penmanship? Do people have a hard time understanding your handwriting? Do you want to take your legible writing to the next level? Hey guys, my name is Tom Otto for Goldspot Pens. You may have seen some of my handwriting in a number of our pen review videos. Ask my parents, it didn't always look so good. In honor of National Handwriting Day, I'm going to share with you Tom's three T's for handwriting improvement. Just a quick disclaimer though, I do not regard myself a master calligrapher like Michael Soul. I'm just an ordinary guy who likes to write with fountain pens. Over the years, I've improved my handwriting so it looked more presentable for video demonstrations and social media posts. My writing isn't perfect, but it's better than most. So here are the three T's to improve your handwriting. Number one, technique. Number two, tools. And number three, well, number three will be incredibly obvious after the first two, so we'll keep it a surprise for now. Speaking of surprises, stay to the end of this video for an opportunity to win a Sailor 1911 standard fountain pen valued at $245 retail price. If you're going to take one tip away from this video, it should be the following. Slow down. And I'll repeat it just one more time. Slow down. Seriously, how do people expect to do anything well if they're always in a big rush? Sit in a comfortable chair with your back straight, feet on the ground in a relaxed posture. Not slouching relaxed, just loose. You want the writing area to be in front of you at an angle that is comfortable for your arm. So if I'm right-handed, I'm gonna have it at this angle. Lefties will have their paper at an angle that's comfortable to them. Uh, some may want to do an over or they want to kind of push their pen. So uh, just have the paper area angled at that way. Um, that works best with your style. You wanna be in a position where you can move your writing hand, arm and elbow freely. Keep your posture upright to prevent hunching over or straining across the table. Your physical comfort level is reflected in the quality of your writing. Grip the writing instrument lightly with your thumb and middle finger acting as support. The index finger or forefinger is doing most of the work in the writing. Keep your wrist, arm, and elbow loose, moving along from word to word as you write across the page. Consistency is key in beautiful handwriting. Our eye is attracted to shapes that are symmetrical, aligned, and spaced evenly. Sloppy handwriting is hard to understand because it deviates from how we expect letters to look. To improve clarity, keep all of your letters grounded on the baseline. Make sure that ascenders rise to the same height while descenders drop to the same level with the same slant. Capital letters should be the same size as other capital letters and lowercase letters should be the same size as other lowercase letters. The spacing between the letters is just as important to keep uniform. The exact height and spacing are dependent on your nib size and personal writing style. The best way to develop your personal style is first by imitation. Handwriting templates and practice sheets are a great place to start. You can find printable templates online, take out a calligraphy book at the library, or buy a workbook like this from Browse. For more inspiration, look at Instagram for calligraphers, bullet journalers, planner addicts, and study grammars. The advantage to watching video is seeing the movement of the writer as they put the pen to paper. Being part of this community exposes you to new techniques, tools, and styles. We'll include a few noteworthy accounts to follow in the video description below. On the route to amazing handwriting, a sound technique will get you halfway there. The right tools can make your journey easier and more enjoyable. The fountain pen is a choice writing instrument for analog enthusiasts because it lays down a fluid line with a light touch. Unlike the disposable one-size-fits-all ballpoint pens, a fountain pen allows for individual expression conforming to your unique handwriting style. The nib is the heart of the fountain pen. Most fountain pens offer a variety of nib size options, ranging from extra fine to broad nib, stub, flex, and other exotic options. The point is, there's a size for every handwriting style. Want to find out which nib size is best suited for your handwriting? Check out our helpful video guide to finding the right nib size. There are two styles of nibs that help accentuate your handwriting with line variation. The italic nib, also called stub, instead of having a round ball-shaped tip, has a rectangular-shaped tip. 
This type of nib provides a thicker downstroke and thinner horizontal line. The automatic line variation instantly adds flair to your everyday handwriting. Like an italic nib, a flex nib also produces line variation. Gentle pressure applied to the tines yield a thicker swell of ink. This type of nib is tricky to get accustomed to, especially if you're new to fountain pens. Aside from the steeper learning curve, flex nibs are a lot of fun and result in gorgeous handwriting with classic copper plate or Spencerian style. Ink is the blood of the pen, an important component to upgrading your handwriting. With so many varieties of fountain pen inks, there's a color and type of ink for everyone. Lefties should be concerned about fast drying ink to prevent accidental smudging. And certain inks have visually impressive properties like shading, sheen, and shimmer. Get a higher level enjoyment out of your handwriting practice by using your favorite color of ink. Paper is the oft overlooked canvas in the art of writing. Using a fountain pen on thin, recycled paper is a recipe for feathering and bleed through, making even the best handwriting look like unintelligible ink blots. When using a fountain pen, invest in suitable paper from Rhodia and Claire Fontaine for the best results. And three, if you haven't guessed it already, is one of the most important aspects of improving any skill. It's also the one that people are most eager to shortcut. Practice, practice, practice. Write down quotes, passages from a novel, pangrams, the alphabet, or simply doodle shapes with your pen. Annoyed by how that certain letter looks when you write it? Find a better version you do like and write it down repeatedly. The key is muscle memory. You know that feeling when you've come back from being away from the office and you're typing on a keyboard for the first time in a few weeks? It feels like you're typing with two left hands, right? That's your brain trying to make those connections again that were once fluid. To foster excellent handwriting, you need to refresh those connections like watering a plant. It doesn't take long, 10 minutes a day will do fine. There are tracing guides and workbooks that help you practice letter forms, like this browse book that's here. If you're short on time and need to get in some practice, all you need is pen and paper. Concentrate, slow down, and focus. Don't be hard on yourself for making mistakes because that's what practice is for. Enjoy the experience of writing, savor it, be fully present with each stroke of the pen. The more fun you make writing, the more you will want to practice. If you're looking to take the first step towards better handwriting today, write a full page using your current handwriting. Using the three T's in this video, take 10 minutes each day for a month to work on your handwriting. At the end of the month, write another full page and compare with your original page. You'll be impressed with the results. Sponsored by the kind folks of Itoya, distributors of Sailor in North America, we're giving away a Sailor 1911 standard key lime fountain pen in your choice of nib size. To enter for a chance to win, like this video and leave a comment below. The topic of the comment, what is your favorite word to write? We'll randomly pick a winner on Monday, January 28th at 10 a.m. Good luck to all of you. If you found this writing video helpful and want to see more how-to pen videos, hit the subscribe button to follow Goldspot Pens. And as always, stay inky, my friends. Take care.